this all week long. The anticipation builds. You're so excited for the match, and once you get it... Everybody, I'm Larry Ridley, and this is the NFL on EA Sports. Two teams will need their quarterbacks to step up and lead their offenses on the gridiron today. It's Manning's Broncos going up against Tanny Hill Dolphins. So let's go down to Denver, Colorado, where Jim and Phil are on the call. Caldwell's the deep back for the opening kick. And Caleb Sturgis looks ready to get this one underway. got a chance to return this one and they stop him from running it out to the 20 mark him down at the 19. he's taken teams from indianapolis and denver to the super bowl he's quarterback peyton manning well when you hear that phrase he's a coach on the field it is not a cliche when you're talking about peyton manning but many people have said probably the best wide receiver coach in the nfl is the quarterback peyton manning and that pass is going out of bounds, incomplete. The offensive lineup includes tight end Julius Thomas, a former college basketball player at Portland State. Yeah, how about that transition? He plays one year of football at Portland State, becomes a fourth-round draft pick, and then he just has an outstanding year in 2013. He is a terrific athlete. Third and five still to go, even after that last completion. Manning's back in shotgun formation. Manning complete as he finds Welker on that throw. That's a nice job by the offense there. Get the first down, keep those chains moving. Give yourself three more opportunities. Offense lines up here. First down at the 36. The game's about three. Well, a short gain on the run that time by the offense. When you're running football team, listen, there's going to be a lot of ugly plays that don't work. You just got to keep running it. The Broncos have it at the 39. Anderson's got it on the handoff. And he's tackled, but not until he picked up the first down. They're able to move the chains after that last run. Welker's lined up now as a slot receiver. And the second quarter is underway with this snap. Jenkins there to make the tackle. Play number six coming up on this drive. Jenkins is so strong, he can do everything on the field. He can rush the pass or beat up tackles, tight ends. How about defending this outside run that time? Stuffs it for no gain. No time to waste. They hurry to the line.
The Broncos have it at the 44. And the quarterback is taken down. Well, that time the quarterback is sacked on the third down, and that's, of course, that's bad. But the good thing is he did not try to force the football down the field and get the turnover. bounce this time as it's headed to the end zone for a touchback. The Dolphins getting set now for their next series. Corners formation here for the defense. First down at the 20. Going deep. Intercepted. They bring him to the turf. That was an awesome job by the defense. They just read the quarterback's eyes. They got in position, and they made the interception. Coming to the line, hoping to avoid being sacked for a third time. First and 10. The defense gets a sack. Well, they got to the quarterback on first down. Sets up second and long. We've reached halftime, and we'll be sending it back to our studio and Larry Ridley as we continue with the NFL on EA Sports. Able to move past the 20 and brought down at the 23. The Dolphins now will start their drive at the 23. Tannehill will be under center. And the give to Lamar Miller. Shakes off the hit for about four. We don't always get to see defensive matchups these days, but today has been exactly that. Low scoring game, and it's because both defenses have really stepped up and done their job. Yeah, a lot of people look at games like this and go, oh, that's boring. I think it's fun to see because we don't get to see it too often. And what it does, it puts a lot of pressure on the players and especially the coaches to make decisions that are going to give their team a chance to win in a game like this. Third down on the way. They load it up now, bring out the jumbo formation. Miller's in on the tackle. Miller's going to be tired after this run. That is a good long run. The offensive line was terrific. And he does a good job finding a hole and picking up those yards. The Dolphins break huddle and show a jumbo look. And he is tackled at the four. The Dolphins will use a timeout here early in the second half. It's now second down and seven after the three-yard rush. Will go with the extra tonnage here with the jumbo set. And they knock him down just a yard away from the first. The defense looking for one more stop here on third down after that run. Third and two here after the run. The jumbo set on the field. Right back to him one more time. And they advance the ball onto the other side of the field. Well, everybody talks about the pass in the NFL. When it's third and short, you got to man up and be tough and strong. Nice job that time by the offensive line. They let the running back get in there and pick up the first down. First down at the 45. Again, staying with the safe plays. Nice run that time. When you run the football like this, over a period of time, it's going to wear that defense out. There's no doubt about it. Nice job by the offensive line. Second down and four. They call his name again. The Broncos' defense will stop the clock here with under two to go as they want to preserve the clock. will be under center. Miller's going to get it again here. He's brought to a halt. The Broncos in a tie game will call a timeout. They clearly want the ball back with a chance to do something. A bound to snap it for the ninth play of the drive. 
There's a lot of extra weight out there for this jumbo set. Back to him. The tackle's made, and the first down is picked up. The Broncos will, of course, call the timeout now to stop the clock. First down here after the run. What a drive this has been. Another carry here. That's a gain of seven. When we were at practice on Friday, Jim, this team was working on red zone offense all the time. Well, here they are. It's a tie game. We'll see if all their practice pays off. Marching down the field and taking their time. Picks up about two. The Dolphins try to run the football that time down in the red zone. It does not work. I would advise them to go to a different plan and not try that run again. Mounting a serious drive. Thomas taking the handoff. Got a flag down here. Personal foul. Face mask. Defense. That's a face mask call. And, of course, for now on, it's 15 yards no matter how you slice it. They don't even have to interpret it anymore. The severity of it, it's a big penalty. Yeah, it is a big penalty. And, uh, you know, one thing, you know why we see a lot of feet takes it across. It is a touchdown. touchdown. You got to give the offensive line just a lot of credit. It's first and goal. They just line up and power the football in there. Nice run, but a great job by the O-line. So with this late lead change, we've had another twist in what's been a great game, and now we'll see if this offense has one more drive in them. Fields the football at the three, and he's met head on right there at the 20. The Broncos now bring their offense back onto the field for the next drive. First down. Pressure on every snap now. First down and 10. Looking across the middle, has his target. Jenkins is the one who brings him to the ground. Second down coming up. Time, obviously, a factor the rest of the way. They'll go to the hurry up here as the clock runs. I agree with spiking the football here, Jim. You spike it, uh, you stop the clock. And it gives you time to have a little breather to think of the situation and call a good play in the huddle. The Broncos will take the snap from the 30. Going deep, looking for Demarius Thomas. A close call on the interception. Delmas had the play on it. They need to make something happen. They tried it right there a moment ago with the deep ball. And here in the last 30 seconds, no one would be surprised if they did that one more time. Yeah, I think they will, Jim. But the defense, they know the situation. They can kind of get back, protect the goal line, play that soft coverage. And he's intercepted. Good job that time by the defense. Not being fooled, being in position. When you're in position, you have a chance to make the play. That time they did, they got the interception. Takes the knee. A pair of true defensive efforts out there today that stood out. But in the end, it's a win for one side, even though the